Hey Internet, it's Matthew Wagner from Flashbang. I picked up an iPad today for development purposes and I wanted to show you one of the things I've just sort of randomly been fiddling around with. So this is a program called Touch OSC, which uh, is a control service program for the Open Sound Control Protocol. And they have an editor so you can actually design your own control surfaces. And they give you a couple examples. And uh, all I'm doing right now is I'm just spewing all this data into a debug program, uh, which you can see is not terribly useful by itself. But, uh, as the name alludes to, Open Sound Control has a bunch of implementations available, and one of them is actually for .NET, which works within Unity. Uh, and this is using Unity's uh, .NET sockets, so it's not using any actual C++ plugin. So all I did was I just linked these two sliders here to the 3D positions of these spheres here. Uh, let me actually make this a little bit more visible together. So, I mean, it's just a really simple test. Uh, I should actually hit play. Uh, and I think, with especially with Unity 3.0, this is only going to work in a standalone. I believe it's all security sandboxed out in, an, in, in the web player. But uh, I just want, thought I would show it to you. I thought it was pretty neat. Um, and this is actually a two-way surface, too, so you can have things within the Unity content or whatever else you're controlling actually set the positions of sliders if you wanted to zero out a bunch of faders or actually kind of make it a two-way interactive thing. Anyway, just fiddled with OSC, which I've never done before, and I thought I'd show you guys later.